Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's look at the problem 36 in chapter 32. Chapter 32 is about light, reflection, refraction. There we have this system. And we can see this is M1 is in the air. So the light come in the incident wave is this way, right? And the incident angle theta 1. And then it get in the glass. For glass, we know the index is N2, and this is N2, this is N3. So N2 equal N3 as 1.5, then come out to the air. So this one, we can call it N4. So now, we know the incident angle, so this is theta 1, theta 2, theta 3, and theta 4. Now we only know theta 4 is 45 degree. We need to find theta 1, theta 2, theta 3. So how can we do that? We will consider the snail law. So we come from the very beginning. The snail law at this point. So this is N1 sin theta 1. This is in the air. Equal to N2 sin theta 2, right? And then at this end, we know this is N3 sin theta 3 equal to N4 sin theta 4. Now, what we don't know is a theta 1, theta 2, theta 3. So this one, theta 1, we don't know. Theta 2, we don't know. Theta 3, we don't know. And theta 4, we know. So very easily, you can see from this equation, N3 and N4 are given. Theta, uh, theta 4 is given. So very easily, you can get theta 3, right? So theta 3 convert this equation. You can get function for theta 3. So now theta 3 is given at there. After you know theta 3, but we still don't know the theta 1 and theta 2, it looks like we need to find the relationship between theta 1, theta 2, and theta 3. So very likely, we can do that. And so we can extend this line. Extend this line, we can say, uh, in this case, right? And we know the, in this angle, on this angle, see this is one angle, right? Yes. In this angle, you can see, we consider this one. Okay, let me change your color. We consider this angle. So for this triangle, for this triangle, so this uh, blue angle should equal to 45 degree, right? Because look at this one, this is a parallel, parallel, this is one like cut it. So this one is a 45 degree, 45 degree. And so in this triangle, we know theta two plus theta three should equal to 45 degree, right? Yes, after we draw this line, we know theta two plus theta three equal to 45 degree. Now we know theta three is given, so theta two we don't know so very easily we can get theta two. Now theta two we find it there, theta three is there. Now in this part theta two is given, so we convert this equation, we can get theta one at there. Thank you.